Yeah, I think uh, just genuine excitement and appreciation to be back here and playing football together again. Um, I think everyone's really locked in and uh, really excited about the opportunity to get to play again. Um, should be a great year for us. Yeah, I think there was a great deal of excitement coming in this year, understanding that games are on the horizon, certainly seeing teams successively, successfully move through it last fall and in the spring lets us know that, you know, this is something that's going to be a reality this fall. So the guys have been really motivated, making sure they're doing the right things to prepare. Uh, with just over about 20 months off, uh, they've been really focused throughout this camp. Um, I don't. I don't think so. I, we know what we need to do, but we do have a sense of urgency about us that we didn't have before, and that's this extra motivation for us. I'd say just a little bit from the uh, kind of idea that we have been practicing for so long. So making sure we're doing the right things to engage our players and get them prepared for game day. You know, a normal year you would have gone through games, a traditional spring practice, and moved into training camp. When you've been practicing as long as we have, it's really caused our staff to make sure we can get these guys focused on executing and having the right balance of uh, active on-field training as well as the off-field training that's critical for success. Definitely overcoming that hurdle of just being so inexperienced, basically. So once we can get through that, then we'll be a successful team. Uh, I think just uh, continuing to learn from last year and manage adversity. Uh, without question, we're going to see it again this year at different points during the season. We certainly learned a lot about doing that last year. But now doing it in those weak turnarounds from one game to the next will be a big part of our season this year. Early on, I mean, there's been guys that shared the same school from uh, little first years, Jacob Romero and uh, Uno Christopher. I mean, those two have really put it on this camp on the offensive and defensive side. Um, it's obviously great to have Josh Brees back. That'll be huge for us. Uh, Alex Wirtz looks good as well, running their ball. Um, Luke Allison's going to make some plays for us, replacing Monty on the outside, which is nice. Um, on the defensive side, we're really talented, really deep at linebacker and DB. A lot of young guys stepping up on, on both those spots. Uh, Robert Poindexter looks great at defensive end. Um, so it'll be a lot of guys, a lot of guys rotating through, flying around. So we'll have a great year. Uh, you know, I think it's, it's, it's been really exciting to watch our defense as a whole. Uh, we had a lot of guys who are in our junior class this year that had opportunities as first years, uh, but now they've really taken that next step and missed a year where they could do it, but have really shown up this training camp. Guys like uh, FJ and David, they've been doing a great job back there, as well as some of our young talent uh, coming in here. Harrison Donovan up front uh, has really shown us some stuff on the offensive line, Jacob Romero, and then a lot of our expected guys have come back in the shape we wanted them to, whether that's a Josh Brees, a Dean Johnson and Owen Roberts, uh, Jack Pollard, a lot of those guys are in great shape this fall. Goals for camp is just to get better, get like get back to football shape and just like get ready, get be prepared to win an ODAC. And that's obviously our goal for the season to win the ODAC championship. So yeah, I think uh, obviously our class in particular has talked a lot about it. We would be the first class since 2005 not to win an ODAC championship, so that's definitely on the forefront of our mind. But uh, just taking things slow um, and not trying to use that as too much pressure, but just that that's our end goal and to accomplish that, we have to take things one step at a time and really just focus on getting better every day and um, loving on each other and coming closer as a team. I think our entire roster would tell you CNU, it's our first opportunity to compete in a long time. You know, we're not focused on ODAC play just yet. We've got to get ourselves off on the right foot, and CNU is going to be that first step for us.